yes, going south as quickly as possible, no matter what. And you see uh, with this camera that it's uh, it's working uh, pretty well right now here, surfing with small genical size. And uh, I think for, for another 24 hours, we're going to have good wind. Then we're going to slow down a little bit. And um, the, tra the, the uh, doldrums look like a... Um, like a passage that's very manageable. <laughs> Alfonso, I, I, I must admit, I didn't let him out of his bag yet. I have my, uh, my bag still under the bunk here to windward, and um, he's still in there. So you're right, it's time to get him out just before the equator crossing. <laughs> Yes, he's, he's very clean and very dry still, so uh, um, he already knows this area pretty well. He's more curious about the Southern Ocean. Um, I'm feeling pretty okay, a bit, uh, a bit sleepy. We didn't sleep much, but enough to, to stay in okay shape, and we do our maneuvers still efficient, and, um, and it works out well. We had some extra workload because... Uh, uh, we did a big repair job on the hydro generators. Um, more or less, to say, uh, Ryan did most of it. The, uh, quite a lot of composite work to repair a hydro generator that had been ripped off by some some floating object in the water. Today is a perfect day. The sea has flattened out, but. Uh, Days before were pretty difficult with uh, crossing seas and rough seas, so uh, boats were tending to nosedive and to, to steer in all directions, and we, we were hand steering for two days, literally. So we, uh, we are through that and pretty happy to, uh, to, to move still very quickly at 20 knots. <laughs> uh, we, uh, we were so, so free to say that our goal was to get in a fifth position. So, um, of course, it's, uh, it's, a, it's a big big challenge in first place to, to arrive with this boat, to keep everything in one piece, and to, to do the trip non-stop. And, uh, and we are still confident we can, keep, can stick with this group. And, uh, and of course, under these conditions, we have, we, I would be happy to... Uh, I think we did, performance-wise, we did uh, what we wanted, that we pushed the boat at all times as much as we could, and we did it so far, and if we, if we finish the race like this, we would be very happy. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's normally true, at true at least, and, uh, but it, on, during this trip, I, I didn't drink a single coffee yet, and it's working out pretty fine, so I, I changed my habit, maybe because of Ryan, because he doesn't share the, the ceremony, and... Um, and then so it has changed. No, we, we were looking up the rig a bit more often, more frequently, and a bit more seriously, but um, we didn't change anything. We, uh, we, we can see that even if the boat pounds into waves or nosedives a little bit, that uh, the rig doesn't bend or doesn't seem to be overstressed. So, so we, we kept this... Uh, same style of uh, that we had before. <laughs>